Rolando Rumi Professor's Ishmael Barroso. The sensational Rolando Rumi came from behind where he was thrashing comfortably on all three judges' scorecards to clinch a controversial nine-round deadly technical knockout victory over the 40-year-old Ishmael Barroso. Until round three, when Barroso landed a solid left that dropped Romero, the bout was dull with the old man chasing the 27-year-old Romero around the ring. In round nine, Romero held Barroso to the canvas with a coughing right that was more a push than a punch. Both fighters were going at each other in the final 30 seconds, each landing when the referee, Tony Wicks, inexplicably stepped in and stopped it, handing Romero the status of the WBA Super Lightweight World Champion. Luis Alberto Lopez versus Michael Conlon. Attempting to grab his first world title, Michael Conlon became a victim of a deadly fifth round knockout delivered on him by the IBA Featherweight World Champion. It happened at the SSE Arena in Belfast. Both fighters started strong, landing power shots and seeking to destroy each other. For the first two rounds, both fighters juggled for control, and Lopez often found himself trapped. But by round three, he was able to take control of the bout, landing several shots to the head that wobbled Conlon towards the ropes. The offensive became deadly in round four, but it was a venomous uppercut in round five that sent Conlon to the canvas in a state that forced his corner to throw in the towel to save him. Joseph Parker vs Fiaga Opelu The New Zealand fighter Joseph Parker checked in one of the fastest deadly knockouts of the month of May when he ended Fiaga Opelu in 8 seconds of the about held in the United Kingdom. This deadly knockout given by Joseph Parker has, according to some big names in the heavyweight division, positioned Parker for a showdown with a big name, maybe a rematch of one of his losses. Life is a bad. Protect yourself at all times. Fight hard, fight clean.